Take it to them. Let's play physical Northwestern football. Focus on what you control. Your enthusiasm, your passion, your focus, and your speed. Focus in, lock it in, control it, and unleash it. One play at a time. We talked about this in the hotel. Press on. Press on. We make a big play, Robes, press on. Big block, press on. Big tackle, press on. Big throw, press on. Big catch, press on. Big interception, press on. Big kick, press on. Stay together, stay united. This is our house. This is our year. This is your time. Seniors, let's lead. Underclassmen, let's go. Cats, it's time to eat. Let's go play more ass. Giving him time. And a look right down the middle. They're going to go for it on fourth down and a long three. And Boucher firing has first down yardage. Fade to the corner. And he's there for the touchdown. So now two minute drill time for Northwestern. They set up the screen on the first play. And a lot of room to run. Look out. Conte down the sideline. And nobody on him down to the 41 yard line of Nevada. That was Sutton. You thought it was Conte, but Sutton's back in the game. Oh my. Third down and long. And he's going to try to make a play with his feet. He dies. First down yardage. Not much of a wind. It's blowing left to right off the high snap. Got a lot of leg into it. And it is good. It's like man coverage all the way around at home again. But it wasn't. Perfectly disguised in McPherson. Running down the right side. And into Nevada territory. Late flag is going to tack on even more. 28-yard attempt now for Villarreal, who's one for one. Oh! Through the two days and everything else, but he was walking around depressed that he couldn't play. <laughs> Roberson. A lot of room to run. It's a foot race down the sideline. And caught from behind inside the 20. The offense fuels off, off of that. Welcome back to those who we lost due to technical difficulties. Northwestern a big play and trying to get back in the game as Boucher's got a foot race. Toward the end zone, just shy. They were down 14 to start the second half, still a lot of time to go. Quick snap, Roberson is going to be in the end zone for the touchdown. Got to have their receivers make plays this week, he emphasized that. Third and a long two, wide open. And Peterman can run for a while. Bouncing off tackles and carrying them along inside the 30. That's Roberson. To the outside. First down yardage with the block. And down inside the 20. Big blitz coming. Bechet saw it. It's set up. Conte, touchdown. Big guy. Stripped to the ball. Northwestern's got it. The strip from Mike Denard. 121 to go. He's going to let it hit, and it'll bounce right into the end zone. So 112 left, and Northwestern has 80 yards to go. Northwestern, which came from 24-10 down to take the lead. Now trying to get it back. Four receivers to choose from for Boucher. And down the middle it goes. That's complete to midfield and beyond. Boucher stepping up. Did a great job of thinking with the football. And inside the 30, down to the 28-yard line. Three wide receivers. Boucher can run again. Gets a block. Inside the 15 and diving ahead down to the 13-yard line. Second down for the 13. Looking for a receiver. The throw is 
Cook for the touchdown! Touchdown with 21 seconds left to go! They march 80 yards down the field and take the go-ahead score with Ross Lane making the catch of the back of the end zone. Crowd making noise, hoping that the Wildcats can end this one right here. Graziano in a lot of trouble. Nowhere to go, the ball is loose. Five seconds left. So I think you run it every Friday and you don't have a defense out there, so it's a little simpler. Graziano is in trouble. And he's down in the end zone. A safety on the final play of the game. And look at the excitement for the Northwestern players. They are going to win this one by five here this afternoon. In a thrilling afternoon of football here in Evanston. I'll tell you what, Northwestern believes. You know, we talked about that adversity hit them. And they, they, they believe that they can win the football game. When they went into the locker room at halftime and the coaches made their steal, when they came out the second half, you could see the attitude that the defense took. The defense knew that they had to play to get the offense and get the team back into the football game. That's it from Evanston, Illinois. Stay tuned. There's just more Big Ten football action coming your way momentarily. For Derek, this is Scott. We're going to take you to Miami of Ohio and Minnesota. Northwestern wins a thriller.